Well, you, can see, you can mm -hmm. see who's in control of the police and who mm -hmm. authorized the police to act okay. in this way. Uh -huh. So there is this, um, there was also EU-Russia summit. Yes, it was uh, last week. Yes, where mm -hmm. the discussion and from uh, the formal discussions were also about Ukraine, but also from the information we have uh, from Barroso and Van Rompuy, there was a serious discussion uh, behind, so to say, the closed doors between Putin and the EU, Barroso and Van Rompuy, mm -hmm. where uh, it was clearly explained that uh, Europe is serious on this and that Russia understood the position. That's what we, mm -hmm. what we know. The, Russia is uh, also facing or having the Sochi Olympic Games at the moment. Yes, this, this could be used as a... a Pressure, exactly, this could yeah. be used as a pressure. I mean, I, I, um, I was actually... And we have called for that. You have? Uh, we have we to have, boycott the, the... Exactly. But how many countries did... <laughs> no, there was a call not to boycott, but that we would boycott. You see, in politics, what we are trying to do is we are trying to mm -hmm. use pressure without actually applying those sanctions. Mm -hmm. Because the problem is, truly, if you do a sanctions, it's like slapping somebody in the face. Mm -hmm. And if you do that, then you stop the discussion. Mm -hmm. We want to talk to the president of the country to explain to him, because he seems to live in a, in a bubble. Mm -hmm. He does not see what the people are, are you sure in Europe Putin are doing. Are has not the... I'm talking the, about Yanukovych. Oh, yes, Yanukovych, um, yes. yes. I, but I think his what administration is, is not plan? aware of what, what is, uh, how you, serious people are and that they will just not go home. Yeah, but no. also Putin, who gives so much support uh, to, mm. to him. Well, we, what, what, we is heard, his, what is his so such What a we heard interest? in Ukraine from the people was yeah. that Ukrainians are different than the Russians. And this is where the mistake was made. You know, well, in what to give sense? an example, 200,000 <laughs> protests when, the, when there is problems with the voting uh, for the president Putin in, in Russia. And after a week, they go home. To give you an example, they do. Here, they do not go home, you know. and they will not go home. They say until this is solved, and they are at minus 20. They are at extremely no, cold weather temperatures, and they are just staying what, there, you know. Um, what we see yeah, in uh, because they have nothing to lose, and they say they will fight for this, you know. And they, you know, they even told me, and I'm talking even about young people. They told me because I told them there is nothing that can break your barricades because they built such high barricades and they put the uh, bags of snow and they put water on them and because it's so cold it is like a concrete block yes, now yes, of ice. Five, five, four or five meters of barricades around to protect themselves after the attacks before yes. they were smaller in December when we were there mm -hmm. the barricades were smaller mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. then they fortified them in order so the police will not yes. come and, and uh -huh. attack them um, and, they, and I said to them only tanks can break this Mm. And they told me, even if tanks come, they cannot take us home, you know, so. Uh, yes, indeed, um, we have European elections this year at the end of May, yes. uh, like every five years. But still, this year will be pretty different to what we used to have in the past in previous elections. And this is due to s uh, several changes. On one hand, in the, in, the, in the system we have, on the other hand, in the context in which these elections will take place. Um, and I think we can really see three big differences compared to 2009, 2004 and even before. Uh, the first one is that for the first time, we, uh, the elections will have a direct impact on the uh, election, on the choice of the president of the commission. So the president of the commission is the head of the uh, EU executive. Um, he was so far chosen by the heads of states and governments. Now with the Lisbon Treaty, what happens is that this person should be this kind of EU prime minister, should be elected by the European Parliament. So that's very important. So what happens is that the, the uh, member states will propose a candidate uh, taking into account the results of the elections and then this candidate will have to look for majority in the hemicycle in, in, uh, in the European Parliament to get elected. So That's just to clarify a little bit.